everyone. Welcome to a whole new way to discover products by speaking directly with the people who create them. I'm Katherine Baker, Senior Director of Product Communications at Qualcomm, and I'm joined by my friend and colleague, Akash Sharma, Director of Product Management. Today, we have a very exciting announcement, a new Snapdragon mobile platform, Snapdragon 7S Gen 3. Today, we're gonna dive into the exciting innovations and hear about why this platform is a game changer for the industry. Before we get started though, Akash, could you introduce yourself? Well, thank you, Catherine, and uh, great to be here. I am Director of Product Management uh, on the mobile handset business, uh, creating and collaborating at Qualcomm for over 10 years now. So you have a lot of knowledge. I'm gonna pull it out of you right so. now. <laughs> for Snapdragon 7S Gen 3, can you tell us a little bit about it and people really want to know, what does the S on 7S Gen 3 stand for? Ah, the S, Catherine, the S. Okay, so see, as industry and consumer preferences have evolved globally, mm -hmm. we've created different segments within these tiers to address those preferences. So let's use our Snapdragon 7 series uh, as an example. At the top of the tier is our Plus platform. Mm -hmm fueling the best in tier devices with monumental performance and power efficiency. An example of that would be the Snapdragon 7 Plus Gen 3. Just below that sits our base platform, which is a perfect balance of performance and price within each tier. An example of that would be the uh, Snapdragon 7 Gen 3, which was launched last year and has seen some considerable success. Now, right below the base, we have our S platform, where we have specially selected features to make our advanced technologies more accessible to consumers across the globe. And an apt example of that would be Snapdragon 7S Gen 3. And that's the one we're talking about today and announcing. Got it. So for Snapdragon 7S Gen 3, what are those specially selected features that we've brought to this platform? See. This mobile platform offers specially, again, selected features to enhance our consumers' favorite experiences or Snapdragon experiences. We're pushing the limits on expectations system-wide with breakthrough performance, powering quintessential Snapdragon experiences. So we're talking, Catherine, we're talking capabilities like support for on-device generative AI, big one, right? Uh, we're bringing uh, on-device gen AI to more affordable smartphones so more users can experience intelligent interactions at faster speeds. Captivating gaming. We're enabling smart features like variable rate shading, or VRS, and adaptive performance engine for enhanced gameplay that our consumers can experience. Camera advancements. Bringing stellar IQ for this tier and stunning 200 megapixel photo captures with a triple ISP and equally crisp video captures with features such as 4K staggered HDR. Love it. Incredible audio. With Qualcomm Acoustic Hi-Fi DAC and Acoustic Speaker Max, we're taking audio fidelity to the next level. And then to top it all off, Catherine, blazing 5G with global millimeter wave and DSDA or 5G multi-SIM capability. And some of these, Catherine, are actually firsts in this series. Incredible. That's an incredible list of capabilities. Thank you for walking us through it. Absolutely. So can we talk a little bit more about performance? You talked about AI, camera, gaming, but what is the raw or the new performance metrics that you can share about this platform? Great question, Catherine. Uh, so in a nutshell, you know, the Snapdragon 7S Gen 3 is bringing more power to the masses. And that's pun intended. <laughs> uh, uh, the Snapdragon 7S Gen 3 has significant performance improvements uh, versus its predecessor, which, was, which is the 7S Gen 2. So let's quickly go over a few of these uh, leaps, as I would like to call them. Uh, we're bringing the latest Qualcomm Cryo CPU with powerful processing for 64-bit apps, resulting in nearly 20% improved CPU performance compared to the last generation. Wow. And that is significant. Next up, an accelerated GPU. So with up to 40% better average graphics performance for top of the line gaming experiences. And then there's AI. So we're boosting the AI performance by over 30% 
thanks to an enhanced Qualcomm AI engine. Now, Catherine, with this kind of an AI, improved AI performance, the goal really is to uh, make generative AI, along with improved traditional AI, accessible on more devices. And then last, but certainly not the least, <laughs> Uh, the 7S Gen 3 is built on the 4FF process node, uh, which helps it achieve approximately 12% overall power savings. Now, you would ask me, what does that really mean? See, Catherine, that's the key to extending these Snapdragon experiences that we're talking about for our consumers by extending battery life. The most important thing that mm -hmm. consumers care about for their smartphones. That, that's another long list of performance improvements. That's, that's phenomenal. Um, so people want to know who are the OEMs and customers who are going to be bringing devices powered by Snapdragon 7 S Gen 3 to market and when is that going to happen? When are people going to get their hands on these devices? Well, Xiaomi will be the first OEM to adopt this platform in September of this year, which is very shortly. And, and going into 2025, we'll see devices from Realme, uh, Sharp, Samsung and more. So Catherine, you can see why we're super excited for consumers to hold the Snapdragon 7S Gen 3 powered devices in their hands. I can't wait to get my hands on a Snapdragon 7S Gen 3 device. Okay, Akash, final question. You've been in this industry for over a decade. So we wanna hear what most excites you about Snapdragon 7S Gen 3. Final question, yes. Catherine. All right. Uh, so I'm going to take a philosophical approach to this one, Catherine. Um, see, the Snapdragon 7S Gen 3 is taking us into a world where technology and affordability are not separate anymore. They're not mutually mm -hmm. exclusive, right? We can speak those words in a single breath. Technology, affordability, right? Uh, with Snapdragon 7S Gen 3, we're bringing to this tier a new breed of uh, IP advancements using cost-effective approaches. And our OEMs and partners love the idea. Right? It's packing all that goodness at an affordable price point, and hence the excitement and adoption. And I don't think there's an argument to that. Thank you. Thank you so much, Akash, for sharing all your insights, all your knowledge. I know we both can't wait to get our hands on these devices powered by Snapdragon 7S Gen 3 come September. Thank you, everyone, for joining us. Thank you.